Hello, it's Audio Base Chris here with a quick tutorial on how to automatically bring in your effects channels uh, when your mixer hears a backing track. I'm doing this on the XR mixer, but this should apply to air quite a few other mixers as well, including the X32. So, to get this set up, all you need to do first of all is to physically connect your microphone to a channel. I'm using channel 1 for this, and make sure your gains are set and everything. Now, you also need to now select a different channel. Go to input and change the analog input to match your microphone channel. As you can see, we've now got the VU meter moving in channel 10 as well. Then go to output and disable the output of this channel from your main mix. So now we have a duplicate of channel 1, which isn't out going anywhere. You can't hear it, even if you turn it up or down. We then send from channel 10 straight to your effects bus. So we add a little bit of reverb there. Now when I bring this fader in, you can hear the reverb kicking in. So that's fine. Uh, we'll leave that down for now, but in a moment we need to turn that up. You then go from this channel to your gate on channel 10. Make sure gate is selected. Bring your threshold up ever so slightly. And turn on your noise gate. Now at this point, you see the red line coming down. That means that channel 10 is now muted until it hears an input signal. Now I'm using channels 3 and 4 for my backing tracks. So if I now select filter, channel 3, so this is now set to listen only on channel 3 and uh, or channel 4, uh, these are stereo pair. And when it hears anything coming on channel 3, then it will unmute this channel and that of course will bring the effects in. So I'll just demonstrate that now. 2, 1, 1, 1, 2, 2. Stop it and you'll see the red bar come down, that's muted it. If you want it to be a bit quicker to disable the uh, effects, bring that release time down a bit and you'll see that it happens almost instantly now. So press play on the backing tracks. Effects are on, 2, 2, 2. Stop the track and effects are now disabled. So very quick, uh, easy setup. If you wish to bring in multiple effects on it, just adjust channel 10 accordingly. Send your sends through channel 10 so we can bring in some delay and uh, why not we'll bring everything in. And if I press play on the track, two, yeah, one, 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 two, everything's in. Stop the track and now everything's now muted again. Very simple, very easy. Make sure that channel 10 is brought up when you turn your mixer on, otherwise you'll have no effects and, not want, and you'll not understand why. And uh, that's pretty much it. Thank you very much for listening.